Yo, what's going on guys? The Eve abilities are live. The new Eve abilities are live right here. Here's her new ability champion page. This is the Eve rework. We're going to be showcasing this later on on my YouTube channel. I'll be streaming it right here at this link. I'll put this link in the description of this video. And as soon as the PvE servers are live, that means Eve will be live. That means I will be live right here. We'll be checking out the new Evelyn rework on the PBE servers as soon as they're live. With that being said, her ability pages are live, so let's check those out. <clears throat> so we have Evelyn right here, the new Evelyn rework. It's been long awaited, so let's check these out. I haven't seen them, so this is like my first reaction, my initial reaction to her new rework. Let's check this out. Okay, so that's her passive. She's just, her passive, is, she still goes invis, it looks like. But I'm going to go ahead and read because I'm going to be playing later. I don't want to be a noob, so let's read together. Um, her passive, after avoiding combat for a few seconds, Evelyn is enveloped by Demon Shade. If Evelyn's health is low, she'll recover it quickly while this ability is active. Starting at level 6, Demon Shade also grants Camouflage. This makes Evelyn hidden from view to all to all except nearby enemy champions. Control wards and turrets. Hmm, okay, okay. So that's our passive. Let's, let's check out the abilities though, man. This is gonna be nice. Ooh. That's it. So it's a skill shot, and then I guess when you get near them... I wonder if the spikes are automatic, or do you have to click on them? Let's, it, it'll tell us here. So the Q is called Hate Spike. I think that's still the same name as the old Q. Um, let's read this. Evelyn lashes out in a target direction, dealing damage to the first un unit hit. If the lash strikes a target, Evelyn's next three spells or attacks on that target will deal additional damage. If the struck target is a monster, a significant chunk of Hate Spike's cooldowns will be refunded. Trying to make her a jungler. She is a jungler. We're, we're going to be playing her in the jungle. After the initial cast, Evelyn can recast Hate Spike up to three times to fire a line of spikes. So you have to recast, it's not automatic. Through the nearest enemy, the spikes deal damage to all enemies hit. Hate Spike prioritizes the enemy Evelyn is attacking. Okay, okay. Let's take this one more time. So you just hit Q again, and then you see those little orbs around him that just go, it, it just trying to show you uh, how many more times you can activate that Q. All right, all right. Hold on a second. Lust dust. Okay, okay. Lust dust. I like it. Hmm. All right, so it just seems like you target someone with this, and then maybe you can get a longer queue off or something. It'll tell us here. Evelyn briefly curses a target champion or monster, briefly revealing her location to her target. Hitting the cursed target with basic attacks or Eve's other spells will expunge the curse, refunding Lust Dust's mana, cost, and significantly slowing the target. If the curse lasts for at least a couple of seconds, expunging it will charm the target. So she got charmed there. There's too many charms now, man. We have Ari Charm, Rakan Charm, now an Eve Charm. Hmm. All right, all right, all right. Just saying that there there are a few, quite a few charms now in the game. If the target is an enemy champion, their magic resistance will be reduced for a few seconds. If the target is a monster, the length of the charm will be increased and the spell will deal bonus damage. Casting Lust Dust does not break Demon Shade's camouflage. Nice. So you can you can sneak up on someone, hit W, and then. Yeah, like, ooh, okay, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm seeing the combos now. I'm seeing the combos. This is going to be nice. Whiplash and Empowered Whiplash. I think this is the ability that we saw on her um, her little reveal video. The one where she kind of looks like, to me, she looked like Rengar. Where she was just going in and she assassinated three people. Nice. Yeah, that's, that's the one. That's pretty cool. Check that out one more time. It reminds me of Rengar Q. See the the way that she dashes in? Nice though. I like it. I like it. Whiplash and Empowered Whiplash. Let's read this. 
Whiplash. Evelyn impales an enemy with her lashers, applying on-hit effects and dealing damage as a percentage of the target's maximum health. Evelyn is then granted a short burst of movement speed. Ooh. Entering Demon Shade upgrades Evelyn's next Whiplash into Empowered Whiplash. And Empowered Whiplash, Evelyn pulls herself to her target before impaling them. Then deals Whiplash's effects to her target and all nearby enemy champions. Alright, alright, nice. It's a nice little gap closer. I like it. That's good. Ulti. Oh No, this is it. This is it. I thought that this, I thought the E was the ability we saw on the video. No, it's this one. I can already tell because look at the uh, ability indicator there. Ooh, I'm hyped to see this. All right, let's, let's do it. Holy shit, okay. <laughs> A little anticlimactic, but just wait until we get into game. It's gonna be better. Wow. Evelyn unleashes her demonic, okay, so it's called Widowmaker. Evelyn unleashes her demonic energy becoming untargetable and decimating enemies in front of her. She then warps backwards. This ability deals bonus damage to low health enemies. Wow. Okay, so those are, are Evelyn's new abilities. <coughs> Let's see what this has to offer us. I wanna check this out. I, I wanna check out the entire page with y'all, if that's cool. I'm also gonna link this page in the description of this video, so if you wanna go look at it yourself and you're like, Fuck it, why am I looking at this video when I can just go see it myself? Go ahead. The link is going to be in the description to this page. Um, but if you want to watch with me, let's continue watching, man. I want to see what this entire page has to offer. I want to learn everything that I can before I actually get into game and play with the new E. Oh, that was dirty. Like, ju just the blink backwards. The teleport backwards, that's nice. I wonder how it determines um, which direction you go in. It's, it's probably just the way that you're facing. Let's see that one more time. Yeah, so she's facing them and then she blinks backwards. Okay. Blink slash teleports, whatever. She used her ulti as a gap closer. That was nice. Ooh, okay. All right, all right. As Evelyn, you're a living nightmare for your opponents on the rift. When you sprinkle less dust on your crush... <laughs> okay, right, okay. They'll know they're being stalked, but they'll have an idea of your location for a fleeting instant. The next few moments are emotional torment for your victim. Wow. <laughs> okay. Once you've finally emerged, you've got precious few moments to enjoy your handiwork. Burst your opponents as quickly as possible with hate spikes and stick to them with empowered whiplash. When you've had your fill, Widowmaker lets you slip back into the shadows. I don't know why, but when I was reading the, these last sentences, I was, I was reading them in Freak's voice in my head. <laughs> Alright. Nice, nice. I think I'm just going to go ahead and use this thumbnail for the for the uh for this video because i'm too lazy to make my own <clears throat> extras without pain how would they know pleasure oh, okay um that's just like her quote and these are the skins i think yeah these are the skins tango e look at her she looks yeah she looks good nice so i'm a twisted if you're new to the channel i'm a twisted fate main i play nothing but twisted fate uh, so Evelyn getting a rework is going to be interesting because if you're not up to date with the lore, TF and Evelyn, they are, I think they're married or they're like boyfriend and girlfriend, something like that. I'm curious to see their new interactions, if they have any, because, uh, yeah, it's just going to be interesting to see if Eve and, and TF have, have new interactions. Because I don't think they're, the current Eve has interactions with TF. So we're going to have to check that out. I'm going to make sure I'll... Get into a game with TF and we'll look at that. I honestly don't know the names of these skins. Only the Eve, uh, this Tango Eve. That's the only one that I know, Tango Eve, because TF's, uh, TF has a skin, Tango Twisted Fate. And these are the splash arts. Let's go ahead and check these out. This is her classic skin. 
I, I yeah, I don't know the name of these skins, but anyways. Is this TF? I don't know if this is TF or not. Could be. Could be. Maybe this is like a little Easter egg that Twisted Fate is going to get a new skin. This could be him. It looks like Jin in a way too though, with his like mask right here. Here's TF though. Nice, my boy TF. Getting it in with Eve. Alright. So yeah, that's it. That's all this page has to offer, man. That is all of it. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that like button, man. But also, be sure. I know you're you're here because you want to see the Eve in game. I know that's why you're here. So, Jacob Snakeup plays Evelyn Rework. We'll be live in two hours. My event says I will be live in two hours, but Riot, they're having an extended downtime for the PBE servers. So as soon as Riot gets their shit together and they send the they get the PBE servers up and running, I will be live. So be sure to uh, sub with notifications on, hit the bell, and don't miss out, man. Don't miss out because, like I said, as soon as PBE servers are live, I'm live. We'll be in game. It's going to be amazing. It's going to be a show you're not going to want to miss. So I'll see you later. Thank you for watching.